This is a video of my Sigineer, Sigineer 18 kilowatt power inverter. It's working fantastically. The sound of the fans is about one third as loud as my old model Growatt six kilowatt that I replaced. Uh, right now it's only hooked up to one battery. Uh, this is a 48 volt, uh, 270 amp hour battery. I have a second battery that was sent back for repair, which is why this is a little bit of a mess, but this came for free with the unit. And it's nice because at a glance, you can see the input and the output voltages and controls. Setup was a lot simpler than with the grow watt. I just simply adjusted this knob to the three position because these are uh, LifePo um, lithium battery, lithium iron phosphate batteries. And then I just set the five dip switches at the bottom to the appropriate settings. These I will be covering uh, shortly when I shut the power down again um, after the test. And as you can see, I've got a 90 amp breaker, even though this thing is rated for 75 amps. And then I've got some thick gauge cable. Goes all the way up here, threads through there. And then it goes into my server slash go room. Here's the critical load panel. This is where all the devices I want to power in the event of a power outage go. These will all be powered by battery backup. That includes my network attached storage, uh, my router, my Wi-Fi and internet, and my media server. There's the original electrical panel. And as you can see, we've moved the wiring from there. But I will say that this unit is much, 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 much quieter than the one that I used to use. It was way easier to set up. Uh, the only downside is that this does weigh 230 some odd pounds. So it was a bit of a challenge for the two of us to lift it up because we mounted it on two, um, as you can see, cross bracing studs which are attached to the vertical drywall studs just to give it extra reinforcement. So heads up for anyone watching this video, this does weigh 230 pounds and you will definitely uh, need more than one person to hoist it up and attach it. But other than that, this thing works great. There's hardly anything to have to configure and set up and it just worked perfectly right outside the box. So I'm really pleased that I bought this.